Hello, Ladybird Spirit Light here. And today I got my friend a puff light. And uh, this one is particularly like clear and gorgeous and just, I just, and the, the clarity really amazes me. So I think I would like to ask Astrid, um, how can we each find more clarity for our life purpose and what we're going through and, and, and you know, what, what, what kind of things, what kind of perspective shifts do we need to get more crystal clear? So let's see what he has to say. Yes, hello. So uh, we would like to let you know about this uh, clarity of which you seek. The change in perspective of, uh, is, is about to where you meet uh, with this, uh, this world and the other. The clarity will come uh, sometimes through the mother line. So there is uh, something divine with the, the divine feminine with it has this, uh, this uh, ability to see the clear, to see the clarity uh, through divine waters, uh, through the, the third eye seeing. Uh, and so one who is uh, born either male or female or other uh, can also uh, tap into this divine femininity of clarity. Uh, this is helps uh, you drop down into your higher self. So you are working with both worlds, the, the 3D and the 5D and beyond. And this is where the two combines. So you can see both the dreaming state and the wake state with utmost uh, seeing ability. Now, of course, you know, this is a journey for you. So the seeing uh, sometimes cannot be so clear uh, because you need to make your own choice, is my dears. Yes. So uh, we would like to now uh, say that we would like to bring in this clarity ability more for you. Uh, we bring this into this this uh, just a bit of a higher heart uh, area you see to open that up for clarity so that you may see the road ahead uh, with a little more focus let's say <laughs> Uh, this, this area helps you cross between worlds, cross between timelines, so you can uh, see more of uh, which way uh, you should lean, uh, which way you should move, uh, which action you should do, which foot should you put forward before the next? Andre e kondro un kosunda ande andre in drum fu kanserende ankaro akrende in kala okusuna ande akari ira okusur tu yara ante in kande ande okuro shukunde ande. There, for some of you, there has been in the past uh, life uh, karmas, yes, and pain that has been layered here. Uh, in the third eye, in the higher heart, uh, that is uh, creating the mist, per se. Uh, we would like to cleanse and clear that today. If we have your permission, we thank you. Okay. 
Uncle entre coro un poco en chicante andre contro o contro otro 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 a que no todo un balón poco le entrecante. We're just moving the stones away, just softly and gently, uh, just pushing the those those areas between that have shut off the light. Uh, which which we want to gleam. These are ancient energies uh, that no longer serve you in this now moment. Okrain shakale shakum palo okshe hande anchitran mbakum bahe kaya ay okore eshakana oyero eshkoro oya just opening up that third eye space ah letting it breathe letting it breathe taking this new fresh breath ah we can breathe <laughs> so this flow of energy can come through now. We thank you. Om bakan shikale kole turum bandre shikale. Andri shukum de kan shikam de shukum boli shikale itro andri ikaye. Mbayo. Hello, I'm back. Um, Asha didn't really say goodbye. He was just took off, I guess. Um, so, but what I really was feeling with that was, I want to say Chitza Itza, um, something around Mexico. Um, at least for some of you, there was, might have been some lives there um, that is like still like got some like layers of uh, feelings <laughs> to work through uh, in the higher heart and the third eye space. Um, hopefully that kind of like, I felt like an opening. It was maybe just a little bit like the sun just cracking through a window so in a way, but it was coming in. So just keep working on allowing those stones, whatever they, they represent, to be uh, just pushed aside, pushed away creating more space for the flow of energy. And um, yeah, so that's all I have for today. And I hope to see you again next week.